High tech businesses in the southwest have been gathering today to discuss improving the way they work and how to boost the local economy. Technology firms have had a long association with Tor Bay, but ever since electronics giant Nortel left almost a decade ago, it's been working hard to win back business. Our South Devon reporter John Ayres has more. It's easy to think Torbay is all about tourism, but it's an enclave of high-tech firms and the hope is that by bringing them together they can help lift the area out of the economic doldrums. Tourism is still very important to us, but if we're going to rebalance the economy and support the alternative economy, which this is, employment is very important, full-time jobs, well-paid jobs, and with a combination of the road that's now started and the inward investment that's coming into the bay, which is very substantial, we see prosperity and a good future for the businesses that are here. There are all sorts of widgets and gadgets on show here, and part of this has been to show what careers the industry can offer. There's a real lack of qualified engineers in this country. Not only are there jobs, but jobs here in the southwest too. I definitely want to go into design, uh, and I'm not sure whether I'm going to go into more electronics or st straight design, um, but I definitely find it interesting in figuring out which ways work the best. The thing is, there's a perception that the engineering jobs aren't here. Hymid Multishot is a company in Torquay which makes plastic parts for things like medical instruments. They see the southwest as being traditionally retail or hospitality. What the young people don't seem to realise is that there's a huge high-tech sector within the Bay. There are many manufacturing uh, companies out there who will take on apprentices. Youth unemployment in Torbay is high. The latest jobless figures put Torbay static at 4.3%, the worst in the region. There's high hopes the new link road will help bring in new business. There's a massive competition with every other location in the UK and beyond competing for similar amounts of inward investment. Um, so it's really important that events like this galvanise not, not only local companies but all, all, also some, 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 of, some of the people from outside of the area to understand what this area has to offer. Torbay Council's confident the economy is changing for the better and predicts 5,000 new jobs will be created in the next five years. John Ayres, BBC Spotlight, Torquay.